you've had multiple significant achievements throughout life. Which one would you say is your most significant one to date? Um, honestly, this book, it, it was tough, man. I, I've had uh, uh, some breaks in the middle of it, reliving a lot of that stuff. Um, but getting the the journey on paper, talking about how I hated myself, talking about how I had to forgive myself for not honoring the memory of those I lost in Afghanistan, um, really showing that struggle. Um, it, bro, there are times where I'm like, delete, delete, delete. This is not going out. And thankfully, word saved <laughs> that progress. Um, even having my mentor tell me it was garbage and it was guarded and I needed to, like, he refused to write the forward until I rewrote the book. I'm like, holy shit, dude, it's supposed to be out in a month, right? Oh. And it's like, uh, I think right now that, that shining achievement has to be the, that I actually put it on paper and I can only hope it makes the impact I'm, I want it to make uh, for people. I think I think it definitely it, it will. I mean, plus, you know, obviously when you were writing, it was sometimes like on Facebook, you were writing outside, like in front of a garage and you had Queen Sadie sitting mm -hmm. down there on the floor next to you. So, I mean, obviously <laughs> you put a labor of love into this book. So I definitely, yeah. you know, I, I, I recommend it. I mean, I've read multiple different aspects of the book and I think it's a phenomenal book because, again, you're, you're telling your story, but you're telling your story through leadership, which is it's, it's the best way of doing it. Right. Hopefully <laughs> we'll see, I guess. <laughs> yeah.